Welcome to the Capital Region Market Update from Harcourt's Real Estate, I'm Rhys Summergreen. Today you join me from an inner south gem that has played a part of many Canberra locals' childhoods. Yarralumla Play Station is an iconic attraction that's been operating in Canberra since 1973. Along with the Western Park Railway, the park has gone under recent major transformations. So today I'm meeting with the current owner and manager, Jason Perkins. Jason, recently you've had uh, a huge amount of renovations to the property. Run us through what you've done so far. Yeah, well since taking over about 20 months ago now, we've pretty much gone through everything and renovated everything. Uh, with the, starting with the cafe, uh, all new seating inside, which has come out of the trains, the carriages we have behind us, which are, were went into service back in 1910. Mm. Um, some very old leather seats, all that kind of stuff. Uh, new fresh menu as well from the cafe with a, a, a chef on board now, uh, mm. making everything from from scratch. Through to Bluebell itself has had um, some some upgrades as well with new paint job uh, and roofs over the, the carriages as well. Um, everyone's concerned about sun these days, so they are. Um, yeah, yeah the, the roofs over those. Um, the biggest new addition we've had is the two 18-hole uh, uh, miniature golf courses, yep. um, Canberra themed. Mm -hmm. uh, so we've got um, the main feature of one of the, the courses is the Parliamentary Triangle. Uh, we've got the Commonwealth and Kings Avenue Bridges, uh, Parliament House, uh, War Memorial, all in line, of, of course. Uh, on the other course, we have uh, things like the High Court, uh, the Shine Dome from the ANU, mm. Telstra Tower, and Bruce Stadium. The great thing about mini golf is everybody loves mini golf. Yeah. Doesn't matter if you're three or if you're 90, um, you can get out there and you can putt and have fun. Mm. Uh, the train as well, um, mainly for the for the younger kids. Yep. But still, we had a, we have our fair percentage of, of grandparents and, and 90 year olds get on the train as well. Uh, the next stage of what we're doing is the start of a petting zoo. So yep. we've currently got a miniature cow, uh, two alpacas, a lamb and a pony uh, with more things to, to come and we'll be doing petting zoo parties. Um, the most ex um, exciting thing that's coming along is the Canberra maze, which is something from my childhood and a lot of Canberrans will remember. Um, we'll be bringing that back to, to life hopefully soon. Um, just to add to the, the things that, that are here to do. Yeah, excellent. I, I noticed recently you've also extended your hours. So what, what times are you open at the moment? Uh, we're now open seven days, which is a, which is a big, big change. Uh, 9.30 to 3 o'clock on weekdays and open for breakfast now from 8 a.m. on the weekends, closing at 5.30. Excellent. And where, where should uh, people find more information about what's your phone number, email, uh, sorry, your website? Uh, we've got uh, our website is yarraps, Y-A-R-R-A-P-S yep. dot com dot au and you can find us in Western Park in Yarralama. Cool. And what, what's your contact number here? 6282 2714. Excellent. Well, thanks very much for meeting with us today, Jason. I'm sure there were a lot of the viewers here today will be certainly interested and imagine you'll probably get a few more calls. Thanks very much. Thanks for coming out. Thanks, Rick. No worries. Thank you. In June, the cold weather certainly made an impact in the capital region market, with 641 new listings hit the market and 584 selling. This does represent a drop in numbers, but the good news is the new stock numbers are declining at a greater rate than sales. So we have less selling stock, but we also have less available. In June, we sold $340 million worth of property with an average sale price of $580,000. These results include 26 properties that sold for a million or more. In rentals, compared to last year, a market has tightened by roughly 15% and a rental prices have improved by 5%, days of market are down 20%. Internationally, slow growth in the global market has allowed the RBA to keep the cash rate at 1.75. China's economy is slowing and the UK referendum sent financial market into shock. The good news is this will encourage international investors to see that Australia is a safer place for their money, even without tightening lending conditions for foreign investors. So in summation, the market is tightening in sales and rentals, which is a common thing in the colder months. This represents a good opportunity to leverage your position by undercutting the market and launching your property now, before the flood of the spring season dilutes the market. We are still achieving great results and we may see more international investors push up prices in the local market. We are currently on an annual trend up in pricing, so it would be a shame to miss out on these fortuitous market conditions. 
If you'd like to learn more about these results and how it affects you and your real estate, please call me, Reese Summergreen, on 0419 650 993 or my co-director, Sandy Funston, on 0414 629 996 to organise a complimentary and confidential meeting with one of our representatives here at Hardgoods Real Estate. Thank you.